Good afternoon. I'm Dr. Angela Moradian from the Moradian Smile Boutique here in Syosset, 516-364-1444. And my email address is uh, drmsmiles at optonline.net. And here I am stuck in the afternoon traffic once again. I was pondering upon uh, some of the patients that I had come across today in the office and something that um, quite often you'll encounter is, um, is actually uh, what happens when you start to get to like end stages of gum disease. And this is what I want to talk about today. If you have been told that you need to have your tooth taken out because of gum disease, I want you to contact me and let me check and see what it is um, that's going on before you take the tooth out. I will tell you, there are teeth that some people consider hopeless or, you know, have to be taken out. And yet, we can maintain those teeth for a very long time to the point that they're not the really, they don't even need to be extracted. And it's something to keep in mind because when you start to take teeth out with gum disease, it becomes like a domino effect. Then the next tooth goes and the next tooth goes and now you have your dentitions falling apart. Before you know it, what do you do? Do you put implants in? Do you start to put implants in? Do you do something before then? And I will tell you very often what, what happens is the teeth start to get loose, they start to hurt. So um, they start to open up spaces what I like to do is take all of your teeth and kind of connect them all together so that they're acting as one unit versus individual unit. And you know, we call that a roundhouse uh, in our field. When you're kind of connecting all the teeth together, one tooth at a time, uh, we place crowns and we connect the crowns. That's how the crowns are made. Um, it's a really nice service and it really will give you uh, a good amount of time with your own teeth in your mouth if you wanted to keep your teeth and again it is something to consider because once you start to take teeth out at what point now you know you start to invest in implants and so forth but you can have bone loss around the implants if you're prone to having a gum disease you can also get something called peri-implantitis so you've really got to look at all the possibilities before you start taking teeth out. And that is really my recommendation. Again, if you have been told you need to have your teeth taken out, please definitely contact me and uh, let me give you my opinion, whether it's via email or you call the office. Again, it's Dr. M. Smiles at optonline.net or 516-364-1444. And I hope that helps. Take care. Bye-bye.